Hello, and today I wanted to show you this BT Freestyle 320 Plus cordless telephone from back in uh, 1997. This was released, but I'm going to show show you this running on the on the O2 the GSM mobile network. If I just uh, show you now, it's not linked up to this, but well, it is linked up, it's, this is not turned on at the moment. So if I show you this, you won't get no tone or nothing, as you can see. It's dead. It's on, but there's no uh, tone on it. Turn it all off. Now if I turn this on. Come on out in a minute. You actually put a, a SIM card in this, in this box here, and it uh, it gets the mobile signal and all, all that. And then you plug this into this with all the wires you can see, and then it will make this run on. Um, whatever SIM card provider you put in there, this will run off it. At the moment we have O2, so this will run now on O2. So now if I try, um, you know, I have a dialing tone. If I tap in the credit line for O2, which is four, 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 four. Yeah. Do that again. Welcome to OC Play and Go. Top up, tear it, and bolt on service. To top up, press 1. To hear your call time or remaining tariff or bolt on balances, Two, to change your tariff, add change or cancel a bolt on. Three, to activate your e-top up card. Four, or to hear more about what O2's got to offer you. Five. Here we are. As you can see, this is for flashing a green at the moment. That's to say that uh, it's uh, ready and obviously. When I uh, have a dialing tone there, it'll stay the green because then it's properly in use. Uh, let me just show you the, the phone I have, which we have on there. It is the, there's a box for it. This is from. Um, 2000, ah, 2000. This phone is actually from uh, 1997. It's quite old. Lovely, a lovely little handset. It's huge, but it is tidy. And obviously, you have the big long aerial on there as well, look. As you can see. When I had this, it was like brand spanking new. I had it uh, from my car boots this, 
for sale a couple of months back but I never used it but the battery holds a good charge on it so yeah it's just show you where the sim card goes on in here you know the sim card goes in here just show you here we are there's the sim card look I have showed this device before on uh, on this channel I thought I'd do an up-to-date one so I had a lot of uh, interest in the other video so I thought I'd do another one and you, and you can also have it you can have it that way you can put the phone that way whichever the case may be let me show you once more then You will notice it's got a uh, light there now saying talking. It's pretty easy to set up. It's pretty easy to set up. Simple. And you also have a little aerial of it as well. just do you uh, an up-to-date video on um, on this fixed GSM signal uh, sender well not a signal sender you you plug your phone line into here as you can see here you plug it into your lock and then uh, you can put two lines on it at once, I believe, is another one there as well. So, yeah, it's a very really, uh, handy piece of kit, a piece of kit like. <coughs> and like I said, if for those of you who's interested in the old uh, house phones, this one is uh, pristine condition. And this one, I believe, was from. Uh, 1997 so it's quite old Oop. quite old so yeah as always guys thank you very much for watching and um, I'll be back pretty soon with another video for those of you who enjoy my videos but I'm subscribed I'd be very much grateful if you did it helped my channel a lot and uh, it made me very happy. Anyway, thank you very much, guys, and uh, bye.